Hey guys, welcome back to Clash of Bando. Um, today we're going to do something a little bit different at Aussie Addicts uh, across the ACA, so the Aussie Clans Alliance. We ran a bit of a um, Town Hall 9 challenge and this is the end of it. Um, and what we've got today is it's Phoenix versus Lance. Uh Phoenix is Shine Eternal's main uh, Town Hall 9. And um, these are the final two Town Hall 9s, so it's attacking tonight for a $20 iTunes card as they both run iTunes. Um, yeah, so what we're going to do is I've got Discord open. It's going to sound like a bit of a microphone -y sort of walkie-talkie setup. That's about the best I've got for now. Bando's not too technologically savvy. Um, and we're going to be looking through Phoenix's base, and then Lans is on Discord with Dave as well, two of our uh, misfits from Aussie Addicts, and um, we're going to be talking about what she's going to be planning on doing this. It's going to be a highest percentage wins. Um, a lot of our Town Hall 9 challenges went to three stars, it went over a period of about eight weeks. I'll link a little picture of who was in there. We had 16 players across three of the clans, I think, and we're hoping the next season goes um, a little bit more. So for us as a clan, it made it um, become a lot more Town Hall 9 savvy. Our 9s built bases for these. They attacked. They used different armies. Dave put up some um, different challenges where we couldn't attack with uh, heroes or we had to use a set type of unit. Um, for the finals, of course, it's no bars hold, everything's in. So, um, say hello, guys. Hey. Up, guys. So that's, um, Dave's very quiet, and that's Lance as well. Um, I guess we'll just get straight back into it. We don't want to make a half an hour video, but we want people to see that, you know, as a clan Aussie addicts, we, we try to get the better out of our, our ideas. We do a lot of Discord talking. There's probably a good six to eight of us that go on Discord, we do also sketch and all those kinds of things as well, but, um... I just lied. Yep. Um, so Shine's going in first on Phoenix. This is Lan's base, we didn't look at it yet. Um, she's gonna have a Valk, Baby Dragon, Wizard, and Archers in the Clan Castle. And what is it? Is it a Stoned Raid? Stoned Gohog. So this is pretty much, um, Shine's main attack for wars. It's a great cleaning attack. Enter on the point defense is normally hard, so on corners. Um, is what's this base run like versus hogs, lands? It's just a uh, freshly built base, so I haven't really ever seen it much. All right, so they, they ate a bomb, which is nice. Got the Jimmy Bob's taken a fair whack of damage. He's lost that early. That jump gets him through a lot of that base, though, doesn't it? Mm. The queen's been sold out. He's not defending his queen, unfortunately. He's probably hogged from the wrong direction. He's gone heavy on that left side, hasn't he? Yeah. He needed a couple hogs. He's got three. There we go. He's picked that up. He could probably hold his ability. Oh, he... oh, should have been a double. Five spot for it too there. So his queen's going to get slowed. Mm -hmm. It's good that he's got trash clean up down the bottom there. It's, it's a percentage based system. So yeah, long side into those heroes is uh, what's going to do it. That second jump was a weird one. A bit early, I thought. Especially with um, not knowing where his golems were. Because they've, they've been sold in midfield now. There's two and a half golems there still. Yeah. His queen's going to get him a he bit jumped. of pew-pew. He put the jump too early. Because if that jump had been further up, or even if it had been left-hand side... He wouldn't have needed to hog that at all. Probably what's cost him. And go the old goals. Yeah, look at look at the amount of meat that was left on those golems. There was heaps. He probably didn't need to do that jump at all. Oh well. It's all live, it's all under pressure. He's got a bit of percentage at least. Yeah, no pressure now. That archer tower's gonna be covered for a second, so what's it going to be? 79% by looks. Yep, 79%. Alright, I'll pause it and uh, we'll go to the next one live. So, we're live again. We're live now. Um, so, Lance has changed her mind completely. I've convinced her to run a different strat. Um, what's the strat, Lance? Tell us what you're going to do. Yeah, 
Shine's base, smash it. Where are you going to run your heroes? So you're going to hero set, naked hero run, where are they going to go? Are you going to go up at 12 and we get a CC brawl? Yep. Up there. I think you. I think you're all over it. Well, you, you don't draw. You don't draw the ground on this strat. So you're just drawing whatever airs there, and that's it. So if it's a hound in the clan castle, you're happy. It's even better if it's a hound. Yeah. Yeah. All right. We don't really need to talk about this, do we? Everyone's listened to us talk about a, a, a queen walk and a baby that we're not going to do. Everyone's waiting. Are you 100% with your army? The army's trained, but, you know. So you're doing a 4 plus 1 with your spells? So where's your earthquake? Earthquake's going to go over. Pers- personal earthquake. So oh. you're taking a haste as, you f- as your last spell, yeah? Let- yeah, haste is going to go over. Let's go. The wizard towers. Any more quick. And this is why we Discord people, because sometimes we come up with plans that are just... That are just too questionable. And then you sort of go, shit, maybe we should trust the Bando and fucking run a different strat. Yeah, yeah. Well, I just didn't like those overlapping air defences, but one thing you do is you have them open to a zap quake if they're overlapping like that. That's right. You leave them open, four plus two. Four plus one. Yeah, something to think about when... Doing your base, do you really want to? Right, let's go. No pressure. Let's. Right, we're live. Pressure I want. Everywhere. I wonder how many people are going to get watching Lanzi for the final, first final at Aussie Addicts. Everyone, A little bit of background noise there. Make sure your earthquake's going. Sweet. Where's your minion? Minion for your clan castle draw. Oh, three babies. Hello. All right, so your heroes have gone a little bit of skew, but that's all right. You can work with that. Good work with your jump. You want to get into your hounds if you can start now. Queen. Oh, shit. Tap that corner nine o'clock if you can, yeah, beautiful. Now you want to get your haste on those wizard towers. Yeah. That's good, you're doing well. You're going to have trouble with that tail expo, but that's all right. As long as that wizard tower goes down, that's right. So now you've got a couple of loans, yep. Perfect. You can start a little bit of trash cleanup if you want as well. Jimmy's going solid. You've got a. Yep. Now you want something in at um, two o'clock. Yep. And now we wait. Was there enough pups? There's enough pups. It's going to come down to the Tesla farm. Oh shit. Oh, I've got the expo. That's got to be it. It's got to be three. Nah, nah, Tesla's gone. What about your baby? Don't forget your baby. baby. It'll be close. Jimmy's going to do a little bit of tanking. Now we wait. Push two times. What about that thing at three o'clock? Are you going to get that? Oh, Jimmy, he's tripping some, he's tripping some bombs. Oh, it's going to be a 99%. Oh, kill me now. It just depends on how quickly that bloody um, baby takes up tanking. He's run on that left side there. Start shooting the baby dragon. There we go. There we go. He's turned. Oh, no. It's a black bomb. <laughs> <laughs> that hurts. That really hurts. All right. Oh, 98%. Oh, Jimmy's tanking. You never know. Go, go the little pup that could. Nah. The little pup that couldn't. <laughs> oh, and you missed the builder's hut too, the BK hut. Oh, well, 97%. If that was a scrim, that would be a very easy second clear. A 
That's funny. Awesome. All right. Champion. I didn't see yes. how many people we had. I'll have to watch the video again to see how many we had. How many were watching, Lance? I don't know. It was like two tens. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to stop the edit there, guys. I um, hope you had a bit of a laugh. That's our first Town Hall 9 challenge finish. Um, how did we go? Lanzi on 97%. And Shine on Mr. Phoenix, he had, uh, what was it, 70-odd percent, 79 percent. So uh, no, th no th three stars for us. Um, yeah, hope you guys had a laugh. I challenge you to a dance-off. Hands off, no trash talk, no backwalk.